Give me sunshine, yeah, yeah. Welcome to Instant Tutorials by The Ruggers, where we every week learn you a new breaking technique. Just do it. Now, my name is Rico, and I'm about to teach you the Ninja Cartwheel. Follow me. And while you follow me, follow your finger to the subscribe button. Thank you. Now, Ninja Cartwheel, it's literally a cartwheel that's a little bit more dynamic, and it's on one hand. So, first thing you want to do is obviously you use your strong hand first for stability, for preference, and this is my right hand. And what you're going to do is you're going to do a cartwheel, really simple, but only on your right hand. So, now what you do is you put your hand down to the ground. And obviously do the cartwheel so your right goes up and your left goes up. Now to make it a little bit more ninja-y, that's not a word but you get what I mean. Now what happens is you use the dynamic from a spring now. So I would try to jump to my hand and let my legs follow. So instead of placing it on the ground, I would do like a little jump. And to start off safe so you don't break everything in your house, that'd be a shame. It'd be good for bad start Mondays. Anyway, you kind of... You kind of just place your hand and you follow it. Just look for your hand on the ground. So you go small jump and kick. Yeah. And then once you get comfortable with that, you can progress more higher and higher and higher. So it goes a little bit higher. And at the point where you get really comfortable with it, you can kind of throw your hand over your own head and go directly over. So it's like, which makes it a little bit more ninja, very dynamic. And again, always good to practice both sides, so you can do it. Yeah. And once you get really good with it, you can, you can use this also as transitions or make your footwork more dynamic on the beat. If you know it stops and you go, everybody goes, yeah. that's the ninja card, but it's pretty basic, it's pretty easy. Take your time with it. Always take your time with these things and make sure your wrist is good. So warm it up, elbow, shoulder, so you don't dislocate anything. And yeah, enough talking. Go practice, get your ninja kicks down. Yeah, practice makes perfect. 10 hours, 10,000 hours of this, and you'll be a master at it. Something like that. But you know what you can be a master at? Like and subscribe. And I'll see you next week for another tutorial. Ready for another tutorial? Hey, click here. Damn, this is what I'm doing. I'm not saying you wouldn't admit it for this way. Okay.